Hello, I'm Daniel Chen. Here are the headlines for this hour. President Bakunet meets with military and related agencies a day after North Korea fires artillery into South Korean territory. She calls for the protection of Western Sea border islands and bolstering defense readiness with Washington. The public's anger and distrust at the ruling Senri party looms large over upcoming general elections. But decisive moves by the president, including a public apology and a reshuffle of top posts, may be making a difference as her approval ratings rise. Prosecutors continue their hunt for the practical owner of the Sunken Toro Ferry, who remains on the run. They are monitoring the homes of some of his supporters and post a $48,000 reward for anyone with information on Yu Bengun's whereabouts. More bloodshed in Syria as at least 20 people are killed when Syrian rebels bomb a tent used for election campaigning in Daraa. Tune in to Arirang TV at 6 p.m. for more.